What's up guys? So in today's video, we're gonna go over a classic physique arm workout now. Okay, to tell you the honest truth, there's no difference between a classic physique workout and a normal workout, but this is to get them clicks on the video so the channel can get out there more. So deal with me please. So in today's video, we're gonna cover a arm superset. So about a 30 to 40 minute workout. In and out, nice and quick, get a nice, a nice little arm pump there. Yeah, so what we're gonna start off with is bench dips and straight bar curls. Way the bench dip and straight bar curls. Easy superset and you can do it pretty much anywhere. So let's get to it. Can keep my hands on myself. Think I'll just them all, put them back up on the shelf. So with the superset, the main thing is it's going to be the first exercise of the workout. So you should be able to do the most weight, therefore the most overload. So a tip with the dips is you don't want to go too low. The reason why is it's going to put your shoulder at a bit of stress. So don't go too low. Go like about 90 degrees and then locking out the elbow. Not high extending, but locking out of the elbow. And then with the barbell course, what you want to do is just get a nice stretch at the bottom and then all the way to the top. Not letting the elbows go forward. And also, what you want, a nice little trick you can do is with your wrist, bend it backwards slightly. So, okay, like, if that's, my, if that's my wrist neutral, then I'll bend it back a bit like that. And it just works the bicep so much more. So, that's the first exercise done. Now, let's move on to the second one, which is. Next superset is going to be cross grip bench press with um, preacher. Easy bar call, that's the right name. Okay, well, three sets, eight to ten, ten to twelve, somewhere around there. Just my little baby girl has a need. Am I coming out of love with you? Ooh, I'm a rebel just for kicks, man. I've been feeling it since 1966, man. Might be over now, but I feel it still. Ooh, I'm a rebel just for kicks, man. With these two exercises, the tips are with close grip bench. Close grip does not mean that your grip must be so close that your wrists touch. Very bad for your wrists and I feel it leads to less trust activation. Basically for me, close grip is just inside of my bench press grip. So if I bench out here, that means this is close grip. So do that. With the preacher curl, because it's a free weight movement, if you go all the way to the top again, there's no tension. So stop just shy of like all the way at the top and make sure to get a nice stretch not too far because then it's gonna pop your shoulders forward which is bad keep your shoulders attracted go down just below 90 come to the top and then squeeze slightly, slightly. three sets it's at 8 to 12 reps now let's go to the next exercise okay guys the next exercise we have is obviously another super set but it's gonna be incline dumbbell curls super set it with like a very high incline skull crusher now the reason why we're doing a very high incline is because your sure, tricep has like two positions that it likes to be worked in. The elbow shoulder flexion and then like push downs. So the elbow flex position is going to hit more your long head and then the push downs is more of that outer horseshoe. And then with the bicep, because your elbow, your shoulders are back here and it's, maybe your bicep attaches in your humeral joint. Therefore getting it in this position fully lengthens it and then you're going to Contract nicely and it feels very good. Can't always be talking science shit to you guys. Okay, I went. Let me kick it like it's 1986 now. Might be over now, but I feel it still, 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 still. But I feel it still. Nice tip for these exercises is for the incline dumbbell curls because we've hit pretty much two smaller head movements as in the when your hands in the super position positions can hit more of the like shorter head but when you do the incline dumbbell curls it'll hit that long head because you're trying to curl pretty close to your body so it's going to hit your outer head a bit more and then with the incline like you can call it incline skull crusher um, you want to pause for like a slight moment at the bottom and then extend again, not hyper extending the elbow, but just to pretty much full lockout. And that's gonna be another three sets. Keep it about about 10, 12. 
that's because like you're getting near the end of the workout and you don't want to make the exercise like you don't want to go too heavy because you put yourself into injuries weight and now we're going to go to the final exercise okay guys so for the last exercise of this classic physique arm workout uh, we're gonna do a super set of cables just to finish off the arms. It's gonna be um, rope, rope hammer curls, super set with rope tricep push downs. Yes, we are using two ropes. The reason is the gym is empty. Like you see, there's like three people here. So that's gonna be the final super set of this workout. Before I get into it, please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you thought of the workout. Let me know if you tried. Share it because it's a very quick workout, so I'm gonna finish up now. Ciao.